Flores is tired, but Flores has a mission to do. And so uh, she doesn't get a break quite yet. Looks like we got this mission right here, and we've got uh, an infestation to clear out. So we're going to do that, and then we're going to try to make progress on our legacy. I've also, even though Flores is normally kind of a snipery character for me, uh, I have equipped her with a pistol because I am so close to getting this. Oh, wait, is that a bloater? Oh, there's a bloater. I'm so close to getting these bounties. Okay, wait, what am I doing? I am. I switch into that. Let's go kill this bloater with a revolver. Got the bounty. Cut him off at the knees. Okay, so I don't need to carry that revolver anymore. So glad it's in my pockets now. But whatever. Huh, I didn't realize that we had Scream Requires in the Dread Zone. I thought they were a Nightmare Zone thing. But uh, since it was just three Screamers together and no other zombies clustered around them, I think that's what that was. Alright, let's head out to this mission. J Hyde said, oh wait, no, Cable, uh, Cable9978 uh, says, anyone else wrap up all the new bounties yet? So you are the second person who's come in here and said that they've wrapped up all the bounties already. Uh, I have not yet. Uh, I think I might have just, I completed one of the new uh, open range bounties earlier uh, in a previous session, and then I'm a, I've just completed my second one. I'm 28 zombie kills with a pistol from completing my third. Alright, I'm going to search the onion farm for a package of prescription drugs. Oh, hello. Uh, I really wish we could chain into finishers. Right now... Right now, it's not on the schedule, but at some point, I would love to make that a lot smoother. Where's my car? There's my car. Okay, now that I know where my car is, let's actually mark that place. So let's take out that infestation on the way home, and then we will work on that legacy mission. Twenty-six zombies left. So infestations are a great place to get a lot of zombies in your crosshair at once. Oops. Oh, interesting. So I don't really use the Gunslinger aim snap ability that often. And so I didn't realize that it's got kind of a minimum range to it. Once a zombie gets real close, it's not nearly as effective. Okay, there went... I don't think I killed him. There went the infestation. Uh... I'm completely out of bullets. Almost completely out of bullets. But that's fine. Let's head home. Then we'll grab a different character who's got a different pistol. Because Flores is exhausted. We'll grab a different character with a different pistol and finish up this pistol bounty. And make some progress on my legacy. straight under my car? Oh, whoa, wait a minute. Um, there are too many of these. Okay. Let's definitely get back home to where all these uh, shooty watchtower people are.
And you know what? Let's kick in some sniper support. I actually don't know how well sniper support does it dealing with armored guys. Let's just let him inside. Let my friends deal with him. Wait, where is my... Where's my storage? Hey. Go away. No legs allowed. No, I'm not talking to you. Okay, I think we got everybody. Where's the storage in this place? And why don't I already know? <laughs> okay, give me a hint, base map. It is... There? That's where I just was. Oh. Oh, weird! It didn't give me the, it didn't give me the orange icon. Ah, oh, that's strange. Okay. Anyway, she's exhausted this pistol, so, or almost exhausted it. Whatever. Let's get rid of that. We've completed the revolver bounty. Don't need that anymore. Let's get her her horde breaker. Is that this one? Yep. Get her horde breaker. Get her seven six two. So she's ready for next time. And now let's switch over to Rhea. And now let's find out what's our mission. Oh, wait, I gotta take control of Ted. Well, pfft, fine. Let's make sure that he's got a pistol he can use, because I still want to get that pistol bounty. Let's get rid of that, and then what should she use? You know what? We just got this Model 92 rifle. Oh, but yeah, it takes magnum rounds. What about. The blunderbuss. Didn't I just pick up a fake uh, a fake A forty seven? Where's that? I thought I picked up a fake A. None of these seem to be it. There it is. Okay, so yeah, I'll let her have the fake A forty seven. But then let's switch to Ted. I don't know what he's packing. Oh, wait a minute. We've got a siege, huh? Well, this place is uh, full of people with guns. We're going to be fine. Strangers have hit my home. Talk to Rachel to see what their group wants. In the middle of a siege? That's going to be fun. Rachel's over here? Sure, let's recruit these new people. I think I now have, a, like, way too many characters. Okay. Let's grab that. Uh, do to do Gotta equip my dude. And actually, let's grab some fire. Where are you, fire? There you are. Oh, another group of strangers has appeared at our, at our door. Yeah, okay, it's, it's been a while since I played this mission. I forgot what happened, so... Let's get a bunch of... Can I climb here? Yeah. Hey there, Tanika. Oh, sorry, can't take you. Ah. Okay, so we got, so it's so weird. We were just doing playing a siege mission and the builder mission where you collect all of the people in your community. Oh my gosh, so many people. All right, Kyle, if that is your real name. They really are coming from all over the place. Is he across the wall? Can I hop this wall? 
I cannot. Okay, well. Ugh. Hey guys, come around to the door, you idiots. So Owen Neffler asks if I've ever played DayZ. I played some of DayZ. Uh, I didn't really have the patience to play a lot of it because it's a lot of running around. Uh, and I didn't have friends to play it with. I don't usually play a lot of co-op. And so I, you know, I know that if you play it with friends, it's mostly like it, it's, a, it's a long, slow social experience punctuated by weird interactions and crazy combat. Um, and... But all I had was the long, slow, running around experience because I was playing by myself and was new. Sorry, I can't take you, buddy. <laughs> we always have to consider the good of the community first. I hope we made the right call. All right. So, let's head out here and kill some zombies with this pistol. And by out here, I mean find the door to my own house. Here we are. They're not that far away, so maybe I don't need to bring the car. Maybe I can run back home if I get into trouble. Okay, there's a couple of hordes. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of zombies over there in the dark. Oh, hello. One. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, and then these guys, I have an offer. I assume that's not, okay, that's not a legacy mission. So, not worrying about missions that are not legacy missions right now, unless I think they might be blocking legacy missions. But I don't think that's the case. I don't think that's going to be how it works, because, remember, I, I was suspecting that that Flores's uh, drug stashes missions might be blocking legacies, but that was not the case. Like, a legacy mission's... Well, a legacy mission spawned crap a legacy mission spawned right right during it so I was what what am I up against ah okay so let's kill as many of those with fire as we can ah what you come from? I could have sworn I saw that guy's head explode. Uh, that's it. There's my bounty. Where did that barrel go, though? What is my shooting skill? Sharp shooting. Okay, that's why her leg just came off with a 22. Normally, you can't shoot the legs off zombies with a 22, but uh, if you got sharp shooting, you can. That was actually that was a f fairly recent update. That was within the past year that we changed that. Originally, sharp shooting was just about penetration, but we realized that wasn't quite enough, so we made it also just like knock the legs and arms off zombies. Okay, it's still going to take me forever to kill all those bloaters with those pistols, but uh, I have cleared that bounty, finally. Like, this has been... Oh, wait, which direction do I think I'm running? This has been three solid sessions here in a row. Three, A full in-game day chasing down this one bounty. 
<laughs> uh, Zombie Brave Knight is, is laughing a little bit at my, my phrasing earlier, and I am completely there for it. Uh, all right. So I'm back home. Why did I come back home? Because I wanted to get a car, and I want to go turn this bounty in and get my mare's leg. That's what this whole night has been about. Getting my mare's leg. So we're going to do that. Get gear. Tally ho! I'm still creeped out that that feral just disappeared. Maybe one of my random gunshots. Since I guess I've got sharpshooting, which means I do extra penetration, maybe one of my random gunshots at a different zombie killed the feral, and that's why it didn't come back for me. Oh, well, good. If I wanted a feral, seems like I've got one now. Whew! All right. Anyway. Hello. Get better at shooting. Wait, I hear somebody else. Oh my gosh, guys. Seriously, die. Okay, anyway. Hey there, Cash. Cash Beaumont, named for one of the kids my daughter babysits. Uh, okay, so we're going to get a Scariffo. Nice. And we're going to get the mare's leg. That's the one I really cared about. So we'll look at that in a second. Let's see. Kill armored zeds with revolvers. Uh, that's silliness. <laughs> it's going to knock their hats off first. Kill bloaters with fire. Let's not do competing bloater uh, bounties again. Juggernauts with shotguns. Screamers with rifles. Armored zeds with heavy weapons. See, I've got some competing ones here that don't make sense to do at the same time. So maybe we'll get Screamers with Rifles, Juggernauts with Shotguns, and we'll just be doing one bounty at a time, probably. So let's head home. Actually, wait, before we go home... Ah, it's so dark out here. I kind of want to show off my mare's leg. Check it out. You can sort of see it. My rifle at my hip. It's a rifle and it's at your hip. It's crazy. And what does it load? 44 Magnum. I've got like 10 bullets of 44 Magnum at home. So I won't be using this a lot. I unfortunately do not have a Magnum ammo press in this community. I think I've got a heavy duty ammo press. So I could make like 50 BMG if I wanted to. Um... I can make, you know, as many 40 millimeter grenades as I want to, but I can't make 44 Magnum. So I've got my mare's leg. I like it. If I make another community that, I, I know, I feel like I've got a Magnum ammo press somewhere in one of my, like, uh, one of my uh, legacy pool characters has got one, I'm sure, somewhere. And unfortunately, because Unfortunately, we don't let you see the uh, inventories of the people in your legacy pool. Uh, I don't know which character it is. Somebody's got a Magnum Ammo Press, and that's who should get that Mare's Leg. But luckily, it's going to be at the Bounty Broker for quite some time. Um, let's see here. Let's send that in. I guess we'll just put the Mare's Leg in our uh, supply locker until we've got enough bullets to use it. But yeah. Someday, someone's... Oh yeah, anyway, I've got three more months before the... Uh, oh, is it three? Maybe it's even four more months. Yeah, four more months before the uh, uh, this bounty pack goes away. So I've got plenty of opportunities to put that mare's leg in the right hands. Anyway, so, where are we... How are we doing with our legacy? Looks like... Uh, they're not quite spawning one yet. Actually, this one might actually be blocking us. I'm not sure. But uh, somebody else in my community has got like, hey, if I were the leader, I would be a traitor and I would do this stuff. Uh, so this might be holding me back from my uh, from my legacy. 
Not sure if it is or not, but it might be. Anyway, so I think we're going to put a pin in this. A later night, we're going to come back and uh, and see if we can get the end, the end timers across the, uh, across the across the finish line. But for right now, uh, I think we're done with State of Decay 2 for the night. So I'm going to put up the black bar, encourage you to maybe subscribe. And uh, the session's not over yet, though, because we got other games to play that are not State of Decay 2. So if you're watching me live on the stream, stick around. we got more to do.